The STEM Scholars Program could best be defined as a collaborative in science, engineering, and technology between the three institutes of higher education in the Bronx for the purposes of providing a smooth transition of students interested in STEM science areas from the community college to the senior colleges by giving them a bridge research experience. The idea behind this would be then that when they transfer across to the senior college, having already had a research experience, they would probably want to continue in those labs for the next two years while they're completing their degree here, which gives the students a tremendous leg up when they go for postgraduate education because they will have a strong research experience behind them. It's a good opportunity to be able to do this lab. Um, he told us about the research, what it uh, research entailed, and he was talking about the one I'm doing is on drug design, and it caught my attention, like, being a student who wants to go into pharmacy, knowing a little bit about drug design gives me a little advantage when I go to pharmacy school, and someday, in case I should go into chemical or drug designing, like production of drugs, that's definitely going to help me in my work. Every one of the students who's coming in this pilot study this time will start at Lehman and start here in Davis Hall in the labs. But several of these faculty will be moving into the new building and so the students will be moving with them. And so they'll have the opportunity of seeing a more traditional and older facility and this very new exciting facility. It's a new building with an exciting new facility. It is designed primarily as a research facility with some teaching. It will become a mecca of science. It'll be uh, a marvelous experience for everyone who's involved in it, and it will lift the image of Lehman College as a quality STEM-based institution in the eyes of the surrounding community. In the world. The STEM program is really designed to get kids into the lab to actually do research and it's designed for them to get a research experience but also to experience a college as well because it's for a lot of them it's a new experience. They're at community colleges but Lehman's different. The presentation I did today was about um, the effect of nitric oxide on assessment in Georgia and basically we all know, I mean some of the professors and those who have taken part in that particular research knows that Georgia produces nitric oxide, but how nitric oxide affects Georgia is not yet determined. So my research is basically to find out how Georgia induces an enzyme, which in this case is glucosamine cis phosphate isomerase on the cell wall formation. been doing some labs in my local school but it's not this one. This is like you're really searching for something, researching about some organism to prove that whether this exists or not. So this experience I haven't had before. Shmel has come as one of the STEM scholars so I have been helping him around with the starting of the project till the finish and guiding him in each and every step that he has to take. And the formula was um, um, concentration of protein. The students were fascinated to see a computational uh, chemist, which is not a wet chemist. He's sitting working with a computer and he's developing software to visualize how proteins rotate in space and interact with each other to try to develop models of potential compounds that are useful for treating disease situations. 
So that's a very exciting area for the students. And it's, it's something they've never thought about before, because you think of chemistry, you always think of wet chemistry, and here it's computational. I'm gaining experience in research, which I've never done before. We wanted to be able to look at this um, graphical representation. Our um, research, as it said, computational job design, it has to do with mainly computer software programs. We are particularly trying to design a molecule, a drug, that will inhibit or stop these caspases from functioning. The lab that I'm working at, we focusing on studying uh, migration of stem cells or progenitor cells to sort of increase the efficiency of other methods that is already in action. Eman is very heavily committed and positioned to work to improve the ability of the people of the Bronx, the students of the Bronx, to be science literate and science ready.